For the second Friday night in a row, protesters marched through downtown Nashville. This time, they planned to risk getting arrested. Welcome to News 2 at 10. I'm Haley Wilkes. Tennessee became the first state in the country to effectively criminalize homelessness today. The state's Republican legislature made it a felony to sleep on public property. Tonight is the first night with that law in effect. And News 2's Allie Lynch is joining us live from downtown Nashville, where people are planning to camp out in protest. Allie. Well, Haley, that rally in March ended here at Commerce Park. This is on 3rd and Broadway. Now these folks plan on sleeping out here tonight to protest. Tennessee-based organizations, individuals, and faith leaders from across the state joined other homeless advocates in a rally, march, and sleep out hosted by a nonprofit open table here in Nashville. Today, Tennessee's anti-camping bill went into effect, making it a felony to camp on all public property across the state, punishable by up to six years in prison, a $3,000 fine, and the loss of voting rights. The homeless community tells me they're angry, and they call this new law cruel and wrong. Simply for existing, you could you could get a felony, which makes it all the more difficult to get into uh, to get into housing, strips away your right to vote. Uh, and harms people in any multitude of ways. Uh, so this is, is uh, simply a law that makes the problem worse than it already is, and the problem is um, already unspeakably bad. Well, we're fighting, and it's just getting started. And as I said once before, for people that live here and feel this, it's just painful to hear about, say a prayer, because we're not going anywhere. We have nowhere to go. Now, the people who are sleeping out here tonight at Commerce Park say they are willing to risk getting arrested in order to prove their point that they believe this new law is unjust and it's causing more harm than good. Reporting live tonight on Broadway, Allie Lynch, News 2.